Grinder pumps are used to shred flushable solids like toilet paper, baby wipes, paper towels, and hygiene products. This pump is equipped with adjustable feet. Adjust them as shown to ensure the pump sits level in the basin. Install a one and a quarter inch discharge pipe according to local, regional, and state codes. Drill a 3 16 inch weep hole in the pipe above the pump discharge to prevent airlock. Attach the switch to the discharge pipe so that incoming water doesn't interfere with switch movement. Never put the off point below the pump discharge. The float switch should be at least one inch away from the side walls of the basin and free of any obstructions. The basin needs to be at least 18 inches wide and 30 inches deep. The pump should be on a solid, level surface. Use a two-step PVC glue system to join the pipe and any fittings needed. Install a one and a quarter inch union above the basin to allow the pump to be removed for cleaning and service. Install a one and a quarter inch check valve above the union to prevent backflow. Install a one and a quarter inch gate above the check valve as required by local, regional, and state codes. These pumps are equipped with a float switch that will automatically turn the pump on and off. Fill the basin with water to check operation. The pump will start when the water level has reached the switch on level. Install a basin cover and gasket on top of the basin. This will contain gases and odors, prevent debris from falling into the basin, and prevent personal injury. Install a vent pipe according to local, regional, or state codes to remove the gases and odors. 